Trick number one, using the side stand. You need to turn the motorcycle around but don't have the room or the muscle to do it. Most bikes can be turned easily by using their side stand as a pivoting point. Simply place yourself next to the handlebar, turn right and grab both grips, pulling the bike in the same direction as the side stand. The rear wheel will come off the ground and now you can simply walk back and drag the front of the wheel, turning the bike. Just a few notes about this technique. First, this will work on the majority of bikes, except in a few due to their weight distribution and due to the place where the side stand is on the bike. If your side stand is placed right in the middle of the wheels or even further towards the front, your bike won't lift the rear wheel like mine did. Instead, it will want to lift the front wheel or even both at the same time. In a situation like this, you have to use a slightly different technique. Instead of grabbing the front of the bike and rotating the front wheel, you have to grab the rear of the bike, lift the front wheel and drag the rear uh, the direction you need. Unfortunately, I don't have footage to exemplify this, and so it will have to be a topic for another video. I'm sure you guys will understand that I'm working with the material I have. So anyway, let's just move on. Second advice, before you try this technique, you should always check for corrosion or for signs of stress in your side stand. Third, the side stand should turn smoothly. If it gets stuck on a rocky surface, it could break or close. And fourth, you should never let the side stand close, of course, and you do that by not leaning the motorcycle too much. Trick number two, anything can be a ramp. If you are too lazy to get off the bike and use the side stand technique, then I have the trick just for you. You just have to remember that anything can be a ramp. Either a rock, or the side of the road, or a log, or anything that you can use to climb up with your front wheel and then use gravity to pull you back. Trick number three, backing up the bike using the front suspension and the front brake. This one requires a little bit of practice, but fortunately it can be practiced anywhere. Simply hold your front brake, compress the front suspensions by thrusting your torso forth and down over the bars, and when the suspension bounces back up, release the front brake and use the momentum to move the bike back. You should use your legs to help the process. The bike won't do it all by itself, but will certainly give you that initial pull that allows you to do the rest. When you push the suspension down, you shouldn't do it all with your arms and shoulders. You should also use your beer belly on the tank. That's why most bikers have it. Unfortunately, this trick will not work very well on BMW from the 1200 GS series, because of the way the front telelever works. Trick number four. This one is basically not a trick, it's just something that is so useful but so many people forget to use it, that I will teach you anyway. Whenever you are maneuvering the bike, while standing next to it, lean it against your hips. And when you want to push it, the initial push should come from your hips and not from your shoulders and your arms. This will save you a ton of energy. These must be my four favorite tricks because they require little to no skill. And on a big motorcycle where energy saving is so important, they can be lifesavers. I hope that you found this video useful and, despite the old footage, that you enjoyed it. And if you did, as usual, please like, subscribe, hit the thingy and share. Share it with someone who just got his first motorcycle and I'm pretty sure that definitely maybe he will pay you the next beer. See you next week and happy rides! Mm -hmm.